it's Michaela, and you're watching Fun Size Style. For today's video, I am creating a Hello Yellow makeup tutorial utilizing the products that were included in my Hello Yellow Sweet Sparkle Beauty Black. It's a monthly beauty subscription service featured around an entire makeup look that they plan out a theme for. If you missed that unboxing, I'll have it linked here in the iCard in the corner. One of these corners, I always forget which one, but I'll have it linked in the iCard. I encourage you to go watch that video to get an up-close look at the swatches of the products in my initial thoughts before trying them on my face. Other than that, I'm going to go ahead and just put these products to the test and create a Hello Yellow makeup tutorial utilizing the products that were in the that month themed box. I'll have all the products linked down in the description box below if you're interested in recreating this look along with me. And yeah, so without further ado, let's go ahead and create this Hello Yellow makeup tutorial. Of course, at first I have to prime my face, so I'm going to be using this NYX First Base Primer Spray. And of course, I'll let you guys know when I use a product that was included in the Hello Yellow Sweet Sparkle Beauty Box. The next product that I'm going to use is my foundation or CC cream rather. And this is the It Cosmetics Your Skin But Better CC Cream. And I'm in the shade Light if you're curious. Next, I'm going to use concealer, and this is the Morph Morphe Fluid, I don't know how to say that, Fluidity? Fluidity. Full Coverage Concealer, and I'm in the shade C1.55. I have a lot of blemishes that I need to cover up, and then I also do a little bit under my eyes as well, but my acne is fully on up again. Just on that acne struggle bus, per usual, you would think by 21 I would be past that, but... No. Nope. I just love the way that this concealer makes my skin look. I don't know. I just really, really love this concealer and I highly recommend it. For powder, I'm going to be using my Maybelline. Fit Me Matte and Poreless Translucent Powder. I promise we'll be getting into the products that were in the Hello Yellow Sweet Sparkle Beauty Box, but it's mainly eyes and lip products. That's why we haven't gotten there yet. But stay tuned, we'll be getting into the products that were in that box soon. Next, I'm going to fill in my eyebrows using my Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz. And as you guys know, I'm in the shade Soft Brown. This is my favorite eyebrow pencil, and it's almost gone. I can't even, like, push it up anymore. So I need to repurchase this because it is my favorite eyebrow pencil. going to just brush out my brows and set them with this Anastasia Beverly Hills Clear Brow Gel Mini. Next, I'm going to prime my eyes for eyeshadow and we're finally using one of the products that was in the Hello Yellow Sweet Sparkle Beauty Box and this is the Koki Cosmetics Prep Up Eyeshadow Primer. I don't know why, but I love trying new eyeshadow primers and I know that seems kind of random because it's very boring makeup product to a lot of people, but I like trying different eyeshadow primers. While the eyeshadow primer sets, I'm going to use the Bahama Mama bronzer by The Balm Cosmetics. Yes, I'm still trying to use up this product. And I wear it all the time, and look how much product is left. Ugh, oh, it's never ending. Mm -hmm. 
Now I'm going to use another product that was included in my Hello Yellow Sweet Sparkle Beauty Box. And this is by Mana Kadar. And this is the Glow Illuminator. And then I'm going to take this mini sponge. And so I'm going to apply this to my face and then use this mini sponge to blend it out. I didn't even realize or plan, but the mini sponge is yellow. And this is a Hello Yellow Sweet Sparkle Beauty Box tutorial. Makeup tutorial, so that's fun. We're going all out with the theme here. You only need just a little bit. And even right there, as you can see, it looks like I used a little bit too much, so I'll bring it over to this side as I'm blending. I just love what a natural glow this product gives. Like, it's not overpowering. I actually forgot how easy this product is to work with. I remember the first time I used it, because I think this is actually a duplicate. I received it, well, not in this box, but I received the Manicadar Glow Illuminator in a previous Sweet Sparkle box, like last year or something. I forgot how easy it is to work with. It's just such a natural glow. We love. Next, we are going to do eyeshadow. Now, bear with me with the eyeshadow here because there is so many different products that we're going to be using because it's such a unique eyeshadow look. I really had to dig into my collection to see what we have because the two shadows that were included in the box are great but they're loose pigments and we need some stuff for the crease and these are better in the inner corner and lid. So I had to again dig into my collection to see what additional yellow like eyeshadows I had. It's a lot of different products so I will let you guys know as we go along here but the first product that I'm going to use for this eyeshadow process for this hello yellow theme is this eyeshadow palette by Ivy Wide Beauty and this is the Ocean Awakening palette. So for my lid I'm going to use this matte yellow right here. I realize I have quite a few shimmery like yellow colors but not a lot of matte so I'm glad that I found this palette that has a nice matte yellow. Next, I'm going to use this eyeshadow palette I have from Tarte Cosmetics, and this is the Don't Quit Your Daydream eyeshadow palette. And the reason I'm using this palette for the Hello Yellow tutorial is I really like the shade Lovey in the corner here. I felt like this was a nice brown put in my crease and it would go well with the yellow. But I have a ton of neutral palettes. You guys know this, I mainly own neutral palettes, but for some reason, out of all my palettes, I really liked this normal color for my crease and I just thought it would go best with the shades of yellow that I'm using. Hopefully my vision is right. used a little bit of work in my crease as well. Honestly, so surprised at how well this is turning out. Like, I really, really, really like this. This is pretty. This is a good look so far. And we're not even to the best part so yet. Next, we're going to use these shadows that were included in my Hello Yellow Sweet Sparkle Beauty Box. And they're um, loose pigments, mineral shadows from Kaylin Cosmetics. So, first, I'm going to use... Actually, I'm going to use dark yellow first and I think I was gonna put this dark yellow in my crease more but I just felt like more brown tone would go better with the lighter tone brown and so I'm gonna probably put both of these on my lid to be honest but put a little bit more of this dark yellow in the crease if that makes sense you'll see when it's done actually I changed my mind already I'm gonna go ahead and just put both of these on my lid because honestly I think that would look best kind of create that layered effect with this yellow theme we got going on here. I 
I cannot get over how pretty this look is. I'm getting so good at blending eyeshadow. I didn't used to be that good. I felt like at blending shadow, but now I'm like, dang, I'm getting good. These Sweet Sparkle Beauty Box videos are my favorite because it makes me as famous every freaking time. But it makes me branch out and try different looks I wouldn't have normally thought of. These are so pretty. So this was dark yellow and then lastly I'm going to use banana and on my lid too. And on, ooh, wow, that's a lot. Okay. I think this is going to be the shadow that really makes everything pop. This look is just stunning. Like, I cannot get over it. I've never done a look like this. And I just really, really like how it turned out. It's very different for me. I like it. I really, really, really like it. Hello Yellow. Right, so next, this product was not included in this Hello Yellow Sweet Sparkle Beauty Box. But I just felt like this look needed a little something something. So I'm going to add a blush. This is my favorite blush from Per Se Professional. Minerals, and this is the Sheer Glow Blush in the shade Cinderose. You guys know this is my all-time favorite blush. I love that blush because it gives just a little bit more color to my face, but yet yeah, it's so, so subtle and so natural. This is my all-time favorite blush. Okay, so next we have eyes. I'm going to use my mascara primer from L'Oreal, and this is the Luminous Base. And then for mascara itself, I'm going to be using the Wander Beauty Mile High Club Mascara. I actually hate the way that I look on camera when I'm doing mascara. I'm going to do this off camera, and I'll see you guys in literally just a second. The last product that I'm going to use for this Hello Yellow makeup tutorial, utilizing the products that were in the Hello Yellow Sweet Sparkle Beauty Box, is the lip product that was included in the box, and this is by the brand Be A Bombshell. And this is their lip stain in the shade Bash. Now, I have never tried any of their lip stains. Here's what it looks like. It's more of a orangey neutral kind of color. So hopefully it looks good. The lip color they include almost every month is what usually ties in the look. So hopefully the lip product does not disappoint. To be honest, I thought this was going to be a little bit more brown tone, a little less red. I mean, it does look really nice together and definitely a summer look, but I just thought it was going to be a little bit more brown tone. But again, it's still really pretty. I'm just giving you guys my honest opinion, and I do still really like how this look turned out. Well, texture of the lip product feels really nice so far, too, and not too drying, in my opinion, a little far in the little time that I've been wearing. So this is the entire completed Hello Yellow makeup tutorial utilizing the products that were in the Hello Yellow Sweet Sparkle Beauty Box. I really enjoy how this look turned out. I'm so impressed with the performance of all of these products. The eyeshadow, I really like that I decided to put both of them on my lid and utilize other products for the crease because I think it just really made it pop and I'm just so impressed. I've Never done a look like this before, and I keep saying this, but I'm seriously just really blown away by everything. And of course, the highlight is super natural, like everything just goes together so well. I don't know how they do it literally every single time. Blown away again by the way this look turned out, and I'm just really, really happy to share this with you guys. I love doing these videos. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below, but here's an overview of the Hello Yellow makeup tutorial look. For the completed Hello Yellow makeup tutorial, again utilizing the products that were included in the Hello Yellow Sweet Sparkle Beauty Box. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I, again, am so happy with how this look turned out and I'm just, I love it. I just love it. So again, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!